Now with the new user interface update, all of my constraints are across here at the top or I can you know, pick some more from the menu here. But here's a neat little trick. If I were to click and were pre-select, for example, these two circles, and then I right mouse click, it will show me the constraints that make sense with what I've pre-selected. And I use this all the time. In fact, I hardly ever go to the menu. Okay, so because I've selected two circles, it's saying, well, you could make those circles concentric. You could fix them in place. You could make them tangent to each other, or you could make them equal size, for example. So let me just draw, for example, a line over here, and let's just do maybe um, a circle over here. Okay, and if I were to pre-select those and right mouse click, it's basically showing me the only constraints I could do for these is to fix them or to make them tangent with each other. But if I had another line over here somewhere, let's just say, and I selected those two and right mouse click, we could see we have a lot more options. We could make them collinear, parallel, perpendicular, horizontal, vertical, and equal. So this is a neat little tip. Just right mouse click and see what options you have in your um, right mouse click menu.